I only have a minute, so let's go. You're gonna love this hammer. Playing a little one, two, when we pick up on the button, what looks like pocket fours because you forgot your glasses. But trust me, it's aces. A little fishy open limps from under the gun. It folds to me limper, no limping. I raise it to ten dollars. Blinds fold and donkey see donkey to do the under gun puts in the ten dollars. Flop comes out pretty good. It's seven ten seven two diamonds, fairly dry flop. So we bet small, we bet ten dollars, and we get a call. Turn is the nine of clubs. Only straight draw that gets there is jack eight or six eight. But there's still tons we can get value from, especially from this little fishy that is a call station. So we size up now. I bet forty dollars, and he calls once again. We're not too worried about straights or trips, as I feel like they would have raised by this point. River is interesting. It's the queen of diamonds bringing in the flush draw. The opponent now checks to me. Oftentimes, I feel like when the opponent hits their draws, they will lead out. So I think about it for a while and deduce it's unlikely they have a flush, especially when I block flushes with the ace of diamonds in my hand. So we go for max value from this call station. We go all in for $150 effective, slightly overbetting the pot. No snap call, so that's good. He doesn't look super comfortable, but he eventually makes the call. I announce my two pair aces and seven. And he looks absolutely disgusted as he shows queen 10 suited for top two pair. Ship it! Like and subscribe, you donkeys.